method. Overriding is a method uh, to change the method in child class which came from parent class. Uh, this is very easy. How you can overwrite a method in Python? I tell you in this video. Oh, oh and now how oh, and please like this video, share your friends, and subscribe to my channel. And if you new on to my channel, the first way you will be subscribed and all the notification bell. When you all the notification bell, when I will be upload any video, any type of video, the notification will be come on to your YouTube. Okay, so please like this video and this video is about Python and we will be comp and this is our Python video. Oh, and now I will not take a long time and this is our Python 72 or 73 class, but we will complete full of 100 class. Okay, so now I will not take a long time. So now let's get started. So, in this video, I will be telling you method override, overriding in Python. So, what are that? Method overriding is a powerful feature in object oriented programming that allows you to re uh, redefine uh, a method in a, in a derived class. The method in the derived class is said to override the method in the base class. When you create an instance of the uh, derived class and call the overriding in method, the version of the method in the derived class is executed rather than the version in the base class. In Python method, overriding is a way to customize the behavior of class based on its on its specific needs. For example, consider the following base class like that. And this is an example of base class like you have seen it. Uh, see it like that. In this basic uh, base class, are the method. Our method is defined but does not have any implementation. It has no implementation. If you want to create a derived derived class that represents a circle, you can override the area method and provide an implementation that calculates the area of the of a circle. Like here is one example. Like I will be copy it and paste it and now when I will be and then it so here I will be what we do here we will do like that and do like that and when I will be do like that in this will the circle uh, the circle class inherits from the same class and overrides the area method the new implementation of the area method calculates the area of circle based on its radius okay it's important to note that note that when in you override a method the new implementation must you the same method signature as the original method this means that uh, the number and type of arguments as well as the written type must be the same another way to customize the behavior of a class is to call the base class method from the d drive class method to do this you can use the super function the super function allows you to you can't uh, call the uh, uh, call the base class method from the derived class method and can be useful when you want to extend the behavior of the base class method rather than replace it for example consider the following base class this is the example then here you will see it the it so in the base class, the area method prints a message indicating that the area is begin calculate. If you want to create a drive class that represented a circle, uh, uh, represent the circle, and you all you also want to print a message indicating the type of shape, you can use the super function to call the base uh, base call class method and add your own message. So here you can see it. this is one example I will be tell you in uh, okay here you will be like you have seen it and and here we will be do it and now here we can do it like that okay and when will be we run it so here I, I will be tell you very easily and it will be print like print calculating area and the print calculating area is very simple. Well, thing uh, I will be telling you in this video, and then uh, let's come to the come in this example. And this is one more example for you. 
here when i will be uh, paste this example here come like that uh, like the in this example the circle the circle class overrides the area method and calls the base class method using the super function this allows you to extend the behavior of the base class method while still maintaining its original behavior in conclusion method overriding is a powerful feature the, the method overriding is very powerful feature in python that allow you allows you to customize the behavior of a class based on its specific needs by using method overriding you can create more a more robust and reliable code and ensure that your classes behave in the way that you need them to additional by using the super function you can extend you can extend the behavior of a class method rather rather than replace it it giving you even greater flexibility and control over the behavior of your class so in this video i will be telling you what are method overriding in python and i hope you can we understand what that method overriding it is very simple help to understand it and i hope you will be understand it it is very simple for you okay like but, but it is a method overriding is very powerful feature in object oriented okay so now i will can in this class i will in this class to method overriding so now i will uh, so now first of all go to the youtube and search my uh, channel by the name of code with pk and when you will be search it so you will be go to my channel and go here and go to my playlist and go to my python tutorial with projects video and then you will be like it share from here and subscribe my channel and all the notification bell and see all the video and when will be all the notification bell you will uh, into the notification when i will upload video whenever so the notification will become very easily so now i will meet you next class of python or or any class so but i will be meet you next class and next very amazing class so for today good bye